Who's this junkie talking to? Oh, shoot. Richie's out there. Junkie alert. Pay attention. Junkie alert. Junkie alert. Oh, yeah. Crackhead Richie's out there. Junkie alert. Let, let's get this party started right. Let's get this party started quickly. Right. Let's just set it off. Set, 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 set it off. Oh yeah, good morning, good morning all my fans out there. You got a Foster 250 with my Barefoot Stock Radio. I didn't get a chance to uh, put the amp in line this weekend, but uh, nevertheless, better late than never. The morning show will continue and will go on. Oh yeah, let's get this party started right. Let's get this party started quickly. Let's set, 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 set it off. I think I heard a homo out there in the truck. I think I heard it. No, actually, he's a retard. Number four, pickup schmuck. He alerted that there's a junkie out there. Thank God. Thank God we have people with good ears. They hear Richie out there and they go junkie alert. Thank God we got good ears out there. <coughs> oh, yeah, and then I heard Charlie. Charlie, hold my hand, Charlie. Yeah, I heard Cracky uh, crying for Charlie to hold his hand. He's another f a freak. He's he's just another homo. He's not a he's not a junk. He's just a homosexual. Pay attention. Where's Spanky? Where's my brother Spanky out there? I thought I heard Spanky out there ripping up the airwaves. Good morning out there, Spanky. Yeah, it's got the crackhead one two seven trying to plug my ears, but I heard you out there, Spanky. Wave it, brother. Oh yeah, it's gonna be a lot of rain today, so you know Crackhead ain't gonna be begging in front of McDonald's today with that rain. Oh no. Pay attention. Crackhead alert. There's Richie out there. Crackhead alert. Junkie alert. Who was the Crackhead ghost talking to this morning, man? I mean, before I, I put the radio show on, I mean, I, I heard a Crackhead out there, 127, just ghost talking the whole morning. What the hell's going on? Is that K2? Even with a new tube in his amp, he's still getting crushed. What? Did I hear he got a new tube? Look like I knew I'd get him to pan the camera. It works all the time. I, I, it's, it's amazing how I pull the strings on that, on that puppet. I do it all the time. Pay attention. Works all the time. If I tell that junkie jump, he, he says, how high? Yeah, it's ghost talking again. Yeah, he, he, I'm surprised, he's, oh, maybe he is, maybe he did go to 37. I, I, I don't know, he might have went to 37 already. But since I embarrassed him with that uh, jumping to 37 while he's on here on this channel and uh, begging for a customer, is anybody looking for me? You sound like a real, uh, a real begging bum, man. Pay attention. Wow, big cracker. You didn't jump to 37? Uh, maybe you did already. Uh, how come it's so silent when you jump on 37 begging for a customer? What happened to the 700 customers you said you had? Satisfied customers. Yeah, okay. <laughs> the only one who's satisfied is your drug dealer that delivers your drugs. You gotta love it. Pay attention. You notice how quiet it gets when the big boss is out here. What the big boss with the hot sauce comes on his channel. You notice how quiet it gets? Pay attention. You know how quiet it is, huh? Pay attention. You don't have to, uh, you know, you don't have to listen too hard. You just, uh, you hear this spectacular studio, great audio. And then you hear a junkie out there with that stock mic sounding like garbage. And then he uh, swears, uh, he promotes stock marks. <laughs> Pay attention. Well, then again, he's a bum. He can't afford the studio gear. You know, it's obvious. <coughs> Wait.
we're talking about a man can't even afford toilet paper. So what does that tell you? He has to use paper bags to wipe himself or, uh, you know, those free papers, uh, Am New York, and uh, <laughs> he got to moisten them with uh, water to wipe himself. Pay attention. Imagine that you got to use M and Metro New York free papers to wipe yourself. How how sick is that, man? How, I wouldn't say sick, but it's deplorable. It's really deplorable that the man got to resort to free newspaper to wipe himself. And you know, being that he's a shitty type of guy, nothing but shit comes out of him from his mouth to his rectum. He's a shitty type of guy, so he must go to a lot of newspapers. But you notice when they skip out there this weekend, you hear you didn't hear a peep out of the crackhead. Mm, I wonder why. You know the guy has to repeat himself like twenty times. He's not being heard unless you're right right outside his window. I know he was asking Charlie to hold his hand a little while ago. Oh yeah, nice and quiet, nice and quiet. Oh, treetop tall, king of this mall. The big boss with the hot sauce, the man with the master plan. Just got down. <laughs> hey Charlie, hold his hand, Charlie. Hey Charlie, go over there, get him a stale bagel. Hold his hand, Charlie. Begging, bitch. What happened, Pedro's, uh, he couldn't make it out of bed? All the painkillers he's taking? Well, then again, with his bad back, He's probably aching, you know? That's why he has to take all those painkillers. Pay attention. You can't make this up. This is pure facts. Oh, yeah. Enforcer Space 250 on YouTube. Enforcer Space 250 on YouTube. Check it out. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Truth and justice at its best. Oh, yeah. <laughs> Richie will be back. He's going to smoke some crack. He'll be back. It takes him about a half hour before his head wears off. He'll be back. His jaw gets, uh, you know, a little, uh, how can I say, a little numb. Nice and quiet. This is the way I like it. Crackhead, junkie, monkey, storyteller free. He's not tired. Crackhead Richie's not tired. He wants to smoke crack. He'll be back. You see, I told you, he don't leave. He don't leave that radio. He never leaves. He even sleeps next to that damn radio. Pay attention. Well, what else does he have to do? He's dying from the monster. He's got that HIV from having unprotected sex with black men. Now look at him. Now he's suffering. He has to medicate himself. 24-7, he's got some drugs in him, one, one type of drug or another, but he's always medicated. That's what happens, you pay, you have to pay, you play, you have to pay now, Cracky. You, you, you have to pay, you want to have unprotected sex with big black men, you got to pay now, you dog. That's why they call him a dog, because uh, he likes the raw dog, <laughs> and the hot dog, pay attention. Hold his hand, Charlie. That's about the that's about the extent of Charlie's IQ. He keys up with a frog. Pay attention. Hold his hand, Charlie. I tell you, man, some of these guys out here got the IQ of a cactus. That's why you gotta have the MTA recordings on 24/7. Yeah, he doesn't have the tube yet. He doesn't make it over the recording. 
At least when he has the tube in his amp, he makes his, he barely makes it over. Without it, he doesn't make it over. He doesn't have the tube. It's going to take him about four to five months. You know, that's a lot of soliciting in front of McDonald's. You get a $200 tube. It's a lot of begging. Excuse me, sir. <laughs> Pay attention. Yeah, but Dallas, sir, I'm trying to save for a tube of my amplifier. Excuse me, sir, I'm hungry. Got a dollar. Oh, yeah, here, here, junkie, here's a dollar. Thank you, sir. Slap. Beg me for a dollar. You gotta get a backhand. I told you I was going to make 19 great again. Didn't I tell you? I keep my pledge. Keep my promises. Just like Donald J. Trump is going to make America great again, I'm going to make 19 great again. I guarantee. How many times is Junkie going to say he's going to be right back? We all know he's not going anywhere. Who's he fooling? When he says he's going to, he'll be right back. That's his code word for he's got to smoke some crack. Pay attention. Go ahead, let you go. Go. Be right back. Smoke that crack. Junkie. <laughs> the mind's a terrible thing to waste. Like you left the radio. Would you smoke your crack? You feeling good now? That's right. You see him say he's back. He's right. He's glued to that radio, and he goes, "I'll be back." That's when you know he's smoking crack. <laughs> Pay attention. <laughs> Pay attention. He's smoking that crack. Listen to him. Listen to his demeanor. Listen to him. Pay attention. I'll be back. You know when he says that, he's smoking that crack. I know he was trying to hold uh, Charlie's hand before. Charlie didn't want nothing to do with that junkie. <laughs> Charlie knows you're a crackhead. He doesn't have to call you a homo. He knows you're a homo. Yeah, Charlie. <laughs> yeah, Charlie. Look, he wants to put Charlie in the middle. There he goes. Putting another man in front of him and holding his leg. Fight my battles, Charlie. Why is 250 picking on me, Charlie? Help me, Charlie. Hey, Charlie. Hey, 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 Charlie. What a junkie. Hold his hand, Charlie. Be aware, as you approach the tunnel... Haven't seen this junkie yet fight his own battles without throwing another man in front of him. Pay attention. <laughs> hey, Charlie, hold my hand, Charlie. I'm not gonna lie, Charlie. Hold my hand. Why is 250 picking on me, Charlie? Jump in front of me, Charlie. You silly fag. You got nobody to talk to, man. You hear shit. You silly crackhead. Pay attention. That's why you gotta say no to crack. Hey, my audience out there, that's why you just gotta say no to crack. Watch, that's gonna be the next announcement. Just say no to crack. Just say no to drugs. You see this egg in a frying pan frying? That's Richie's brain on crack. <coughs> Pay attention. That's going to be the next public announcement. Richie's brain on crack, a frying egg in a frying pan. That's why I tell you, you just got to say no to drugs, say no to crack, and you'll never be whack. Then you won't be out here saying that you're marrying a shot day, that you have uh, 15 badges, that you're inheriting $24 million. See, that's all K2. That's K2 talking in his uh, psychological disorder that he's suffering from. Pay attention. Yeah, dog, uh, I got 20 badges and uh, uh, yeah, I got McNightmares out there. Look at this guy. You're, you're, you're looking at a man. You're looking down at a, at a, a 
vagrant and you're not any better. And you got the nerve to put him down. You're a waste of a load, Richard. You are. You're a real junkie. He's embarrassed. He's embarrassed. You know, when you put him on blast, he gets very irate. Pay attention. He's got the nerve to make videos of a local vagrant around McDonald's. One day that guy's going to snap and break Richie's head open. Watch. Pay attention. <laughs> then he calls the cops on him on top of him. And when the guy goes, hey, hey, Richie, Richie, show me your badge. I don't have any badge. I'm suspended without pay, dog. You lying, bitch. You don't have any badge. You never did. You never will, you junkie. It's all in your mind. Hey, dog, I don't have any badges, dog. Richie, Richie, uh, show me your badges, Richie. I don't have any. I'm suspended without pay, dog. You lying, crackhead. Poor guy, man. He was looking for help when they were escorting him off from the McDonald property. Yeah, and you, yeah, you snitched on him, man. You're a rat. Even, even, uh... <laughs> Even the Teflon Don, the guy he calls the Teflon Don that solicits in McDonald's with him, he even said, Richie, you snitching, man. Wow, that was embarrassing. I, I tell you, I would have never keyed up again. But then again, that crackhead has no shame. He's a rat, a junkie, a begging bum. He has no shame at all. <laughs> Ask him, when is he marrying Sade? When's the wedding? <laughs> you gotta love it. Route. Then he's saying he's marrying the FBI director. Yeah, what happened to him? He, uh, didn't he get fired? So I guess the wedding's off. <laughs> you notice how you, he tries to key over me? He doesn't want to hear me spread the truth about him. Pay attention. He was going to marry Jane Combs' daughter. Pay attention. I didn't know that was uh, Shaw Day was Comey's daughter. Damn it, boy. Then he says it was Joe Pistone's daughter. Who the hell is he marrying? Who's who's this Shaw Day? <laughs> you can't make this shit up. You can't make it up. You just gotta sit back and laugh. <coughs> That's why you just gotta say no to drugs. You gotta say no to crack and you won't be whacked like crackhead with you. Hey rabbit, hey rabbit, why are you making all that noise in my radio? Country rabbit, hey country rabbit, 250 say why are you making all that noise in my radio? Country rabbit, you making too much noise in my radio. Rabbit, you making a lot too much noise in my radio. Hey, country rabbit, you making a whole, whole lot of noise in my radio. Two five zero set. So when I just got down. Hey, hey rabbit, why you making all that noise, rabbit? Hey rabbit, why you making all that noise in my radio, rabbit? Two five zero set. So when I just got down. Rabbit, you making a whole lot of noise, Rabbit. Hey, country rabbit, you making too much noise in my radio. Hey, Rabbit, hey, Rabbit, you cutting off a whole lot of mud ducks. Hey, country rabbit, you cutting all the mud ducks off of my radio, Rabbit. Hey, Rabbit, you cutting off all the mud ducks in my radio, Rabbit. Hey, Rabbit, you cutting off all the mud ducks. Hey, Rabbit, you cutting off the junkies and the monkeys. Hey, Rabbit, you cutting them all off. Hey, Rabbit, oh shit, Richie wants to suck cock, he said? Damn it, boy. We don't want that homo shit out here. Hey, Rabbit, we don't want no gay shit out here. Rabbit, let him know I got his mic. Hey, Rabbit, hey, Rabbit, you cutting off the mud ducks, and I'm cutting off the junkies. Rabbit, you know who said so. 250, just get down. <laughs> you 
better tell that junkie you better go to the goodie store. That crackhead 127 better go to the goodie store if he wants to be heard out here. He better buy himself a new two. 250. Boss with the hot sauce, the man with the master plan just got down. Looks like the ice cream man's coming to help Richie out. Look at that. Pay attention. <coughs> Hey, Rabbit, you're making a whole lot of noise in my radio, Rabbit. You're doing about 10 dBs in my radio. Lord have mercy. I hear you, Rabbit. Hey, Rabbit, you're dropping about 10 dBs in my radio right about now, Rabbit. Uh, you're taking all the mud ducks out of my radio, Country Rabbit. 250 said so, and I just got down. Hey, Rabbit, tell that boy I said go to the goodie store. Hey, Rabbit, you taking the mud ducks out of my radio. Clean my radio out, Rabbit. <coughs> tell that boy he better go to the goodie store. Tell Crackhead Rich you better get a tube because the MTA recording is taking him clean out of my radio. Lord have mercy. Nobody talking. You can't take out the MTA recording. You're not qualified out here. Listen, he do a lot of dick sucking to a guy that he can't hear. Don't take out the MTA Shame on it. That boy better get a new tube. Someone hold his hand and give him a couple dollars so he can save for that new tube. Pay attention. Hey, bro, we gotta take it over, right? yeah. They took his ears to teach him a lesson. And you and you took an, and you take everyone's Bozak out here to teach you a lesson. Pay attention. Oh, look, 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 listen to him. He's a, mum, a bumbling, a mumbling junkie. A, but, 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 but look, him, he started. Blah, 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 blah. Which way did he go, George? Uh, my name is Richie, uh, uh, and I, I'm, I'm, I, I, I like K2. <laughs> Let me hold your hand. That's what crack do to you. Pay attention. Listen to Richie and listen to what the effects of K2 and crack. Pay attention. Then you say to yourself, damn it, boy. If that's what crack does to you, shit, I don't want to, I don't want to do that shit. Man. Just listen to that junkie 127. One minute he's king of New York, he's a drug dealer. The next minute he's the chief of police. Uh, the next minute he, he's marrying Sade. The next minute he has 14 badges. <laughs> Psychosis at its best. Along with K2, man. That makes him even more delusional, man. When he fucks with that, when he lights up that K2, Lord have mercy. He's all kind of superheroes, man. <laughs> it's all in his own words. That's the funny part. He claims that I'm making it up. Just pay attention. So funny video game. You gotta love it. This gate don't lie. This is the Tunnel. <laughs> I hope he gets a tube soon, so at least I hear him over the MTA recording. Damn it, boy. <laughs> I told a junkie, if you go to the Barclays Center and meet up with me, I'll give him a tube, man. I'll, or at least a, a money. I'll give him a thousand dollars in cash, plus... Plus, I give him the video that I have of him, and he was smoking crack at 194 Utica. I still have that. If he wants, I give it to him, man, on a thumb drive. I'll hand it to him. Well, you know, Mr. Enforcer, I'm about to make you an offer you can't refuse, man. Come on, you're going to meet me at the Barclay? Come on, let's do this. Sir, I will meet you at the Barclay. Come on, let's do this. I want to. I want him to meet me at the Barclay. Push on him. By the commission tri-state you have, okay? <coughs> Post the video, you call the time you want me at the Barclay after that. All right. All right, I have the, the uh, thumbnail. I actually thumb drive. I have the thumb drive with me with a thousand dollars cash and we'll meet at the Barclays. How's that sound? No, the only thing that got twisted is his brain when he smokes crack. That's the only thing twisted out of <laughs> Like I said, all right, you meet on my terms. I'm not meeting you where you can start screaming for the cops and screaming for help that I'm attacking you, that I'm doing this, that I threatened you. Barkley's son has plenty of cameras. This way you can't make up any story that I, uh, 
I, I came to assault you. All right, a public place. This way, you can't hide under behind anyone's leg. You can't scream for the cops. It'll be nice, nice and open, you know. It'll be uh, plus. I have my body cam and my partner will have his. This way, there's uh, eyewitnesses, you know. This way, you can't claim uh, that someone try to attack you. You start screaming like you usually do, like when they uh, stole your electric bike, you know. Pay attention. All right, so let me understand if I. <laughs> He thinks I got a beef. There's no beef out here. There's no beef out here. I'm just, ex I'm just providing truth and justice and exposing that junkie. There's no beef out here. I don't have no beef with anyone. You're gonna, you gonna meet me there. He thinks there's beef out here. You know, he, you know this isn't a butcher shop. That's what I thought. There's no butcher shop out here. There's no beef. I told him Barkley Center. He never showed up. Not once, but twice. I gave him a three-hour. I gave him a three-hour window to arrive there. I mean, how much does it cost to get on the subway? He's three stops on the express to the Barclays Sun, and he still didn't show up. Not once, not twice. Not once, but twice. He wouldn't show up. He was in fear. He was terrified. Fear and common sense always gets the best of that crackhead. Pay attention. Must have been real scared, so he said he was going to meet you there. <laughs> wow. Oh, that's what I call Yeah, that's what you, that's what you call pumping off the mic. That's what you call getting punk off the mic. When they invite you, not once, but twice, and you don't show up. That's what you call a biatch. Like I said, after you post that video... Now, he's going to make all kind of excuses, man. He's going to make all kind of excuses. I'll post the video when I'm ready to post it. Yeah, you ain't going to tell me when I should post it. Once you meet me at the Barkley, I'll hand you the thumb drive with the video of you smoking crack at 194 Utica, and you can post it yourself. How's that sound? Well, you know, if you didn't tell everybody out here... Push on them. Push on them, audience. Hey, drivers, push on them. Tell them, yeah, Richie, go meet them. We want to see that video. Push on them. Push on them, drivers. Go ahead, Charlie. You're one of his fans. Push on them. Go ahead. Hey, uh, Charlie, go ahead. Push on them. He'll listen to you. Push on him, Charlie. Hey, Charlie. Hey, Charlie. Push on him. If they pushed on you, the point. <laughs> what a joke. Tommy, you came off that key, all you had was post the video, there'd be a rap out here. Hey, Richie, everyone calls you crackhead, Richie. So what, what, what else do we need to prove that you're a, a crackhead? We know it already. It's in your own words. When you used to smoke, when you used to do, who was it? When you used to smoke coke, you were the hardest smoker around. Your words, man. That's all, those are not my words. Did you forget about those words? Well, maybe you were undercover when you were crackhead back then, too. What was that? Oh, that was an undercover assignment. Okay. So you're a junkie for 50 years because you're an undercover agent. I got it. No, no, we all got it. You just... I got it. I got it. Pay attention. Pay attention. You got to love it. You can't make this up. Well, I'll tell you what, there must be a lot of people out here smoking crack with you, man. No, there's no one smoking crack with you. You are, you are a solo crackhead. No one's saying that there's people out here smoking crack with you. You're a crackhead. You're the only one they refer to as crackhead, Richard. Well, you know, that's the beauty about radio. They you rumors. It's the beauty about radio where you can uh, provide truth and justice and people can get alerted to what's going on out there. That's the beauty. They want that truth and justice. Truth and justice, the American way. That's the only way I know how to do it. I want to see truth and justice. Pay attention. Pay attention. But they want truth and justice. Alrighty then. You want to see crack at its best? You just go to, go to, uh, what is it, 46 at Wintrop. 46 at Wintrop. You got the biggest crackhead in Brooklyn. His name is Richie. Crackhead Richie Radio. Actually, just crackhead Richie. I won't put radio, but there is a Richie radio out there. I don't want anyone to get a, to get confused. It's, he goes by the handle of crackhead one two seven Richie. Just crackhead Richie. No radio. How close am I to that truck, Miami? But if you want if you want truth and justice at its best, you go to YouTube and you put in Enforcer Space two five zero. Enforcer Space two five zero Monday through Friday five a.m. The 6 a.m. excluding weekends, holidays, and vacation. Check it out. A fossil. 
Enforcer Space 25 on YouTube. Five star renom. Five star show. You made it that way. So it's going to continue. It's going to continue to be five, five stars unless you guys out there change it. But if you want to see Richie at 194 Utica smoking crack, push on him to go to the Barclay. And you'll, uh, you'll, you'll be happy. And, and finally, the truth. The truth in video, in video form will be uh, provided in case you don't believe me. <coughs> but then again, you know, you'll still, you'll still say, oh, well, but that was back then. You know, you got to give him a chance. No, no, he's still smoking crap. Pay attention. Pay attention. Push on him, audience. Push on him, drivers. Push on him. Tell him go to uh, to the Barclay Center and meet with the enforcer so he can give you that thumb drive with that video. Push on him. <coughs> anyway, I got to get out of here. It's been a pleasure. It's been a pleasure providing truth and justice. Until next time, you got the enforcer. You got the enforcer 250. Monday through Friday, 5 a.m. to 6 a.m. Excluding weekend holidays and vacation. Check me out on YouTube. And uh, don't forget, ladies and gentlemen, if you feel depressed, if you feel uh, you want to do that, don't do it. Don't do it. Don't let temptation, don't let the devil get to you, man. Look at Richard, 50-year-old junkie. I had nothing to show for him. Nothing to show for his, uh, his begging for 50 years. <laughs> 50 plus, actually. You don't want to be like that guy. You don't want to be a junkie monkey begging in front of McDonald's at Utica and Clarkson. So, you know, just listen to him and, 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 like, look at him. Go see him. Go give him a dollar. It's like a circus act. Give him a dollar and he'll jump up and down and say thank you. Thank you, sir. But uh, don't take my word for it. Go to... Uh, Utica and Clarkson and McDonald's over there, and you'll see a junkie, a little midget with stubby little fang fingers and stubby little hands, and clothes three to four sizes too big. You feel bad for the guy. It, it really humbles you. You're like, damn, I can't smack this guy. I feel bad for him. Here's a dollar. Thank you, sir. You know, so, you know, do yourself a favor. Just say no to crack and say no to drugs, and you'll never be whacked. That concludes my show. God bless everyone out there. Enjoy this day. And enjoy the day after. They call me a force of 250 with my barefoot radio somewhere on the lower deck. Until next time, remember, don't despair. Because 250 will always be there. 250 off the key, and I'm back wide. making all kind of excuses, damn it boy. Just show, just push on him. I, I can't stay. Just push on the junkie. Tell him to show up at the bar. Stop making excuses. Roger on the white trucks, baby. Roger on the white trucks. So we'll show up. Uh, just push on that crackhead 127 to show up at the Barkley. I gotta go.